Hey guys, Crypto Dad here again. Happy Cyber Monday. I've been telling you all week about the great deals that you can get on various hardware wallets by taking advantage of the Black Friday and Cyber Monday sales that are going on right now. Uh, I've talked about Ledger devices. I've talked about Trezor devices. I've talked about a lot of different hardware wallets. And I hope that you're taking advantage of these deals to get your hands on a hardware wallet for keeping your crypto safe and secure. But I'd like to shift gears a little bit today and talk about the Crypto Tag product line. Now, these products are ways for you to store your 12 or 24 word backup phrase safely and securely. What do I mean by that? Well, uh, I've done a lot of videos on hardware wallets. And one of the most common things that I hear people say after they watch one of my videos is great video, like the device, really cool, really neat, what if it breaks? And the perception there is that everything is contained on this device. Well, it's not really contained on the device. The device is basically a keychain which allows you to manage your crypto that's stored on the blockchain. But people tend to think of these devices as all or nothing in that if the device breaks or gets lost or stolen, then the crypto is gone. And that's not really the way they work. They're great for managing your crypto, but they're not crucial for maintaining custody of your crypto. The most important part of a hardware wallet is the backup phrase. The backup phrase is written down when you first set up the device. So they come with little cards that you can use for writing down your backup phrase. Now, I know it seems strange when you first open a hardware wallet to write down a backup phrase for an empty wallet. I felt the same way when I first encountered backup phrases. But the backup phrase is more than just a bunch of words. It's a cryptographic code for backing up the master private key of your hardware wallet. So once you have that master private key initialized on your device, it's the key that generates all of your sub wallets, all your Bitcoin wallets, all your Ethereum wallets, all your Cardano wallets. Every wallet that you create on this hardware device starts with that master private key. And the master private key is stored offline in your backup phrase. So if anything happens to the device, you can get a replacement and restore using your backup phrase. And then you will regain access to all of your crypto wallets and all of the balances that you had stored on those crypto wallets. But you'll notice that the cards that come in the hardware wallets are made of paper or cardboard. And that's not really a durable medium for storing a backup phrase. That's where CryptoTag comes in. CryptoTag is metal medium. It is waterproof, fireproof, fade-proof, and uh, even bulletproof. So the good people over at CryptoTag have sent me one of their Zeus models that I'm going to demo for you, show you how to get it unboxed and set up, and how to imprint your backup phrase onto this medium. They also sent me one of the cases for the Zeus, and this cool hodler water bottle. So I'll show you how you can get your hands on all of these products on their webpage here shortly. But the first thing I'll do is show you how to get this thing unboxed and set up and how to transfer your backup phrase onto this medium. So let's get started. All right, so this is the crypto tag here. You're going to use this in conjunction with the backup phrase that you wrote down when you set up your hardware wallet. Now, I just have three words on this list. Of course, your list will have all 24 words. I'm just going to give you an example, starting with three words. We'll go ahead and open up the box here. All right, you'll see the setup guide here that gives you some step-by-step -step instructions on what to do here. It also contains all of the words on the BIP39 backup list. Now, this is an industry standard list of words. Every backup phrase is taken from this list of words. So it goes all the way from 1 to 2048. So each word in your backup will correspond to a number in this list. And you're provided a conversion sheet 
for generating these numbers. Once you've got that done, you're going to transfer the numbers onto the crypto tag. I'll show you how this works. So I've got tissue there, I can write that here. All right, and of course you'll go ahead and write down the rest of your words on your list. Notice that there's two sides here. We can go all the way from word number one to word 24. All right, once you've written down the word, you'll take your little guide here and you'll look up your word in the list. I assure you, your word will be in this list. So we'll start with tissue. You can see here that the word tissue is word number 1815 in the list. So we'll just write 1815 here. And then the next one is stage. You see the word stage here is number 1698. And uh, the word forum. We can see here that the word forum is on the list here and that's uh, 734. But make sure that you write down all four digits. All right, and you'll continue on and write down all of your words and all of the corresponding numbers. Once you've got that done, you'll open up your crypto tag here. You can see that they were nice enough to send me a monogrammed version, which I think is pretty cool. All right, so you'll remove these clips here on both edges and open it up. And then you've got your storage medium here. Each word in the list is represented here. Uh, word number one, word number two, word number three, word number four. Make sure that you're very careful when you do this Make sure that you're very careful when you copy these numbers out of the word list and make sure that you that each word corresponds to the proper number here. All right? You don't want to write word one, word two, because this one is number seven, right? So just make sure that you write word number one, word number two, word number three, and then just correspond as you go along. Now notice here that you get some earplugs in here. I was kind of curious about why uh, you had these earplugs, but the uh, tool that you use, the tool that you're going to be using here is going to make a pretty loud pop when you uh, push down. So that's probably why they gave us the earplugs. You'll also notice that they've given us some matches and you might wonder, well, why do they give me matches? But uh, the obvious reason would be to burn this paper when you're done. You don't want extra copies of your backup phrase laying around for someone to come across in your trash. So you can put the earplugs in if you want, set your matches aside, and start with word number one. As you can see, my word number one starts with number one. Uh, 1815. So I'll start here. I've got uh, a section for each number. So I'll basically start by putting the tool over the correct number and just push down. <laughs> that was quite a sound there. All right. And as you can see there, I've got number one marked. All right. And then we'll just go on to the others. I've got my little trusty magnifying glass here if I need it. Just move over to the next number, which is eight in this case. And there we go. It's a good thing they provided those earplugs. Uh, the next one is number one. And my next one will be number five. All right, and there you go. You can see that I've got the first word uh, stored here on the crypto tag. All right, it's pretty cool. Now you might be wondering why are we punching out numbers like this on this uh, titanium? Uh, there are other solutions that actually have uh, letters that you can arrange, 
but these suffer from a couple of disadvantages. The first is disadvantage is it's possible to actually drop one of those and mix up the letters, which would be disastrous if you were uh, trying to do a restore. These letter-based solutions are not pressure-proof. So it's possible that under a certain amount of pressure that these types, the, the letter-based solutions could break and mix up the letters. The crypto tag found this solution in this format. Not only is it waterproof and fireproof, but it's also pressure proof. It can withstand a great amount of pressure. It's even bulletproof. Once you've finished the first set, you'll move down to the second set, punch those, go down to the third one and punch those, and just go down the line until you've uh, finished up. And then when you're done, you'll just close it back up again. You can use one of these cool cases, like the one that I received. And it's a very attractive container. And then you can put this somewhere safe and secure. Then, of course, when you're all finished, you can set this one to flame. Using the matches provided. Probably want to do this maybe in an ashtray or a fireplace so that uh, there's no trace of your backup phrase. Now, this solution is good for years. You can pass this on uh, from generation to generation, and it's going to last for many, many years in the future. So no discussion of the crypto tag would be complete without all of the physical resistance that is built into this device. It can withstand extreme temperatures. It's, of course, waterproof. You don't have to worry about it getting wet. And it might just save your life. It is also bulletproof. So it is a very sturdy medium for storing your precious backup phrase. It's also something that you could pass down from generation to generation because it will withstand the test of time as well. Here on their website, you can see that the crypto tag has got a 20% discount for their Black Friday sale, which you should take advantage of. Uh, they also have a couple of other cool products. So if you check out their website, you can see that they've got the Zeus product, uh, the Thor product, which holds more backup phrases, and the Odin. This allows you to create a Shamir backup, which basically creates parts of a backup. So you have three parts of a backup. Now, this is compatible with the uh, Shamir backup that's supported with the Trezor Model T. They even have a bundle where you can get the Trezor Model T along with this. And as I mentioned over here in the uh, shop, they've got all their deals here in one spot. They've got that cool leather uh, case that I showed you and that uh, hodl bottle for uh, keeping hydrated while you're hodling, right? So a lot of great deals on their website. I'm going to put links to this down in the description below so that you can get yourself set up with a great backup solution for storing your 24 or 12 word backup phrase. Very important. If you have any questions about anything I did, please throw them up in the comments and I'll do my best to get them answered. Don't forget, I do a live stream every Saturday night, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Please join me for the live stream from Michigan where you can throw out questions and I'll do my best to get them answered. Hope to see you there. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you'd like to subscribe to my channel, I would appreciate it. When you subscribe, there's a little bell that you can click that will allow you to be alerted whenever I post new content. Once again, thanks for joining me and hope to see you again soon.